name is Deborah Keppel, and welcome to Cabana Talk with Ab Fab Women. We are here at the beautiful Red Rock Resort in fabulous Viva Las Vegas, and I am here with some very absolutely fabulous women who I would like to introduce you to right now. Right is Christina Sorensen, and on my left is Cassie Smith. And we're going to be talking to Cassie. Cassie is a designer in the luxury resort market, and she writes a monthly article for uh, Luxury Las Vegas. And she's a TV host with HGTV's John Daly on yes. a show called um, Daly's Designed by Cassie. Is that yes, right? that's kind of our working name, right. but we, we do, yeah, absolutely. Well, Cassie, welcome. Thank so happy you. you're here. Thank so you. So happy you're here. Thank you for asking me. I'm glad you're here. It's just, this is fun, isn't it? This is absolutely <laughs> a great concept that you're doing. Oh, thank this you. Is so fun. Thank so you fun. so much. Good for you. Thank you so <laughs> much. <laughs> well, I guess since you're the design expert, i got a question for you. Okay. What is the latest trend as far as color, style, furniture, um, and the industry? Application as far as resorts or do you well, mean homes or overall? Is there like a trend overall? Or um, well, every year, and what this what comes out at the beginning of the year is that Pantone sets a, a color, their Pantone color of the year, and it was turquoise this year, um, which is kind of you know it, we it's all it all evolves, it all comes back. Sure. Um, but what's really great and what we've seen through the trends and what we've seen um, obviously that markets put out there is using the turquoise, which works fabulous with resorts, mm -hmm. and so which is my market, um, and which would be exterior, so you're doing a great uh, pool, you know, in cabanas and you can bring it into the interior. That uh, teal or that turquoise is being shown as an accent, mm -hmm. um, where maybe in the 80s we were seeing, you know, more of the muted uh, teals, turquoise, mauves, oh, yeah, the all those, and the, the greys, and, yeah. you remember yeah. those, yes, all yes. those colors. We're seeing more of a punch. We're seeing more of that turquoise, that teal punch, mm -hmm. and using it as an accent. Mm -hmm. So your walls, um, all of your palette, um, maybe your upholstery, um, is you have an accent wall maybe of a teal, or you're having obviously your pillows or um, a throw out of um, a throw, or you're using your bedding in the teal, and you're using the grays, or we're using obviously um, that light gray, that platinum steel color oh, that, yeah. that that's, and that's, the, what worked with the chrome. That's been very very popular for the last two seasons out in the consumer market. Mm -hmm. That gives a little bling. Absolutely. You know, and I, you know me, I like the bling. <laughs> Yes, it does, and you can, and we see that. We see the bling where they're tying in the, you know, the the little um, jeweled um, crystal beads on pillows and at the end of throws sure, and, sure. and tassels, so that bling is that. thrown in there. But out in the consumer market, in the ready-made market, um, you're seeing you're still seeing that, you know, the chrome and the and the, the platinum and the and the steel grays with the the punch of, of teal, uh -huh. you know. So it's more of that muted background. And then using the the teal as the um, how has uh, the economy changed things in homes and even in resorts? I mean, as far as design, and how well, people are doing things. Well, people are doing things. What's really big right now, and, and is we've got our niche word staycations. Uh -huh. And truly, I did a piece for Luxury Las Vegas magazine in the June issue, I believe. Called it was our our issue was on staycations, or and and my my. Um, my section, it's called the home front, and, and we um, basically, um, we talked about the fact that people are staying home more, and what I did feature is a local um, Summers Furniture, I, a local resource, and she does this kind, she does cabanas, and she makes the, she actually does a lot of the, the pools for the hotels, mm -hmm. but what she's doing is she's offering a line now of, of, of outdoor furniture nice. that is inspired by the hotels, by these and I love, I love the outdoor pools. settings, like outdoor living rooms, and when I yep. can someday, I'm going to have like a outdoor kitchen, the whole works, and you know, and just, I mean, just these cabanas, yep. the setting, and that is just gorgeous, you know, just to be around, it makes you feel good. It really does, so she kind of introduced the line to, to show people that they could do it in their own backyards right. and saving money in this economy and spending more time at home, but mm -hmm. and, and 
and entertaining at home or exactly. and creating that whole atmosphere like if you were to go out and right. to visit a resort and spend the money to do that. So that's a real trend that's right now. People are doing that. They're staying home more, um, entertaining more at home, enjoying their home surroundings a little more, spending more time. I think that's truly the trend if you're relating it to the economy. True. You know? That makes sense. Definitely. Absolutely. And I think a lot of people are probably just uh, redoing their homes too and not moving into brand new construction. And yes. Kind of staying in their homes and probably, you know. Yes. Remodels are very prevalent. Um, people are reupholstering pieces and repainting and yes, remodeling yes. rather than looking at moving. Uh -huh. um, hard when you're trying to expand if you have to expand because of family or whatnot. But um, builders are trying to do things more affordably. Obviously, you see the builder market, the new builder market, they're coming way, way down in prices. Um, yes. Being that I also do real estate and luxury market, it's amazing what they're offering now uh -huh. as, as opposed to five years ago. Oh, it is. Um, yeah, and the resale market. Um, you can obviously, we all know about the tremendous deals, but you can buy, uh, rather than building ground up, people are buying homes in the luxury market for, you know, a um, million dollars, uh -huh. where they were buying, they were two and a half million dollars, uh -huh. you know, five years ago, and then remodeling. And putting the money into the remodeling instead yes. of up front with the house price. Absolutely. Very good. Absolutely. Yeah. And you have a book you're working on? Yes, I have a book, and it's hopefully almost finished, and it's called Destination Design. Uh -huh. And it, it basically, because I spent uh, 10 years solid in the resort market for a lot of resort developers on the West Coast here um, in Hawaii. So, um, and I loved it. I had to say every day I loved my job, you know. To, and, but, um, so what I've done is I've compiled, I, I uh, had all of my uh, projects professionally photographed. I, I did, uh, turnkey design is kind of something that I um, really latched onto. And, um, and embraced and, and massaged uh -huh. and, and do it very well. I like that. That's, yeah. yeah that's so um, I so what I offer to the developers is go in and do all the uh, pools and restaurants and all the, the clubhouses, and then we go in and we furnish the homes. That's ready to go. Cabana, yeah, yeah, the, the uh, villas and whatnot. Uh -huh. And people in the second home market and in the vacation market, that's what they want oh, to do. Of course. They, they don't want to have they to They want to pack their suitcase and they're there. Yes. So I was just to say, you know, the whole visual I give is, you know, that we, the turnkey people are arriving with, prior to their arrival, their boats being delivered to the dock and their um, Lamborghinis and coming, being delivered into the driveway and then their, <laughs> their Picasso's being hung. So it's kind of like, then they oh. come with the toothbrush. <laughs> Whole new world out there. <laughs> I know. That luxury market, isn't it? It's oh, wonderful. Yeah. You're like, oh, I'd love to. I want to be that person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I want to be that person. <laughs> Thank you. That's what I want. Well, that probably let you use it yeah. for a while, huh? You set it up, maybe. <laughs> well, and you know, I met some great people, but they, it is really also part of a concierge whole. It's selling, and my book, The Premise Destination Design, is also understanding how you design trends, colors, um, elements, tiles, whatnot, how you're designing for, for a resort. So, taking the theme of that resort or the topography of where it is in the world and actually bringing it in into so the interiors. Yeah, so, so it's more than just theming, but the photographs I have, fabulous photographs, have been done by some fabulous photographers and I'm booking them. So it's kind of a cocktail table book, but also a trends design book mm -hmm. telling you. When is it coming out? Um, within the year, hopefully. Good, yeah. good. So it, 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 it'll be coming. Yeah, we'll have to it's well, thank you, Cassie, for joining us, and uh, thank it's you, been Deborah. fun. It's been great. I love this. Good for you. I love this concept. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so fun. much. Thank, thank you. you. Everybody have a wonderful day, and until next time, take care. Bye-bye.